What's up, everybody? Welcome to another episode of the Knowledge Bomb. Boom, boom, boom. What's up? Episode 402, The Future Method, aka Hanging Bands. I learned this at Westside. So, we programmed this if you want to do the conjugate bench day. Treadway and a couple of them dudes did this today. Basically, what it does is it helps you out of the bottom, almost kind of like a slingshot, but it gives it to you at the top. Danny likes it, giving it to him at the top. I, that was way too easy. The fuck so, out of <laughs> oh, it's terrible. Hopefully those bands don't stop. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, <laughs> what you're doing is in the future method, you're setting yourself up just like a normal bench. You're gonna come down. It's gonna, obviously the bands are gonna stretch. When you press up, it'll give you the band, it'll give you the bar tension like towards lockout. So, what happens is you do conjugate max effort work, you can overload at the top, it's kind of the opposite of the bands pulling you down. And there's a lot of guys that really believe that it helps with your CNS, helps you overload, helps you handle heavier weights. Now, the one caveat, that's the word I can use. Big word for you. Big word, is that if you do this too often, you get weak off your chest. Now, Jake Emery, who's one of the guys in the crew, super fucking strong, he's really fast off his chest. So the overloads like this helped him a ton. For guys that are really weak off your chest, you probably will do better doing the, doing the stuff off the incline first and then flat. So future method, like I said, learn it at Westside, but you gotta remember at Westside, they use bench shirts in their competitions. So out of the bottom mimics what this is, which means you're getting most of the load at the top. Future method 402, 